so today session we are going to discuss the a new item in the ms word so which is more important normally uh, you will have assessment and the final end exam theory practical so you will have the uh, this today's discussion item okay so here now you are familiar with the home tab so the bold italic underline so this part we already discussed so then insert tab also some of the item we were used so design also some part we used so the page border so layout reference today we are moving to the mailings okay so mailings before discussing about the uh, mailings normally uh, when you are applying the university colleges after application so you will receive that um, exam aptitude exam letter interview letter the particular letters you will receive normally there are 1000 or 2000 students they will apply for the university colleges so when we calling for the aptitude test test so we want to send the 2000 letters so the each 2000 letters those who are preparing here they are preparing individually the 2000 letter they are typing sub uh, one by one then how they can do the things so this is not related with the email so the mail merge not related relevant with the email okay so this is something related with the postal mail like that okay so uh, i will explain with the real scenario so if you want to send some 2000 or 5000 the same letter so with the changing of the name address some particular details you can use the mail merge so for those purpose you can use the mail merge so i will explain with the example so once you uh, no once you practice this example you will get some idea so here i am just typing some letter so the two addresses here make it bold okay call for the exam student name student id city mobile number so then so the these are the details then thereafter they will have some letter so during the particular place at during this time you will have the exam so some other thing interview or whatever the things then after that finally the signature of that relevant person okay so like this you will have the letter so here there may be a one particular person a b c d likewise there are different different details so this letter we can call the template so the first you want to have the template so if you want to send the 2000 letter for example you are getting some letter another one is getting some letter but the template are same only your name and the your address will change there okay so here first i am saving this letter on my desktop i have already created folder mail merge so let template okay so i already saved then file new 
blank document so once you put the applications after that they will have your data okay so they will enter one by one no they can download from the internet or if you are applying by some application filling some online form they can easily download otherwise if you are sending by the physical letters then they want to enter the data once okay so here i will insert the table the name id city mobile number that's enough name id city mobile so then i am going to enter the data one by one twenty twenty two slash f m t slash zero two Okay, so likewise, I am entering the data. Finally, I am saving this. Save as browse. Then the same place, the mail merge data. So I am having. Just I will open my the particular desktop mail merge. I am having two word document. one is data another one is letter template okay just i am opening the letter template here i am going with this mailing okay so here you can see they are in this tool bar so the right and insert field preview results finish a hidden state okay so only the start mail merge create both the visible so here i am going to start so here you can see there is two different things we can include here one is type a new list type a new list mean you can create the new database or data set another one is use an existing list so now i have the existing list so i already prepared the table as a word document so then i am going to use that particular table here 
use an existing list so here just go to mailing data just i am going to open once i opened you can see there the old the uh, toolbar items are activated now here just see here just go to to insert merge field i am going to insert the particular person name then to insert merge field i am going to insert that particular person city again here name id city mobile okay just preview your results now you can see the particular first one second third four fifth six seven so i am having the seven data seven data are displaying here if there may be a 2000 members 2000 data if you have so you can get the 2000 letters within a single connection so single mail merge connection you can get the 2000 now i will tell you how i can get the these seven letters separately so you can see here only one letter is available okay go to finish mail merge if you want to print just print a document you will get the seven different letters or else if you want to edit individual or if you want to have as a word document so just click edit individual document select all the document then click okay now new document will open once you open the document particular document you can see there there are eight pages seven pages so the seven different different letters we are getting so what i told you that particular interview scenario or aptitude test scenario so you all are familiar with that not only the interview aptitude so it's may be some uh, exam uh, that uh, uh, application form or maybe the uh, hall ticket so admission cards anything we can print even your certificate or whatever the things so once we have the data we can use this mail merge then you can we can multiply multiply the items okay so here you can see with a single click we are getting the seven different document so file save as browse desktop mailings final all Yes. Once you completed mail merge, you will have the three different files. This is the template letter. This is the final all seven letters. This is your data. So whatever the data you are having, so you can have the data. Okay. So just I am closing these. i am going with the new word document okay so mailings here i am going with the type a new list this is another method so if you don't have any existing data so you can create the new list here so you can customize the item so the title first name last name so company name i don't want okay yes address line 1 i don't want address line 2 i don't want city stage i am renaming as a post other items i don't want or email address also i will have okay so now i am going to enter the name mr
okay so just i am clicking okay button here now they will ask you to the place to save the data set okay so i am creating this new folder another folder in much to just opening my data okay. so once i store this my data you will get that access database files okay so the particular data whatever the things you have entered here the same data you will get it here so title the first name then the space last name then and city then and the post then email so once you enter this data as like this then after that any place so any certificate or any letter so you can have the multiple items in a single click so this is one way so if you don't have the existing data set or database you can use like this way the simple method you can use the word uh, tables and create the data sets then you can connect with the word document even though not only word excel data sets also you can have so excel or my esql or whatever the things any data with a table so any the collected data as a tabled format you can connect with this mail merge okay so this is the way so you can prepare the several documents or several letters or any items with a single click so this is that mail merge so very important uh, when you are practicing with the microsoft word okay so you have to practice so that's all